Let's say that I'm a, a realtor that is in your marketplace. Why would I want to come and join forces with you? Well, the biggest problem that most agents have and every business has out there is finding the business. And we really have the opposite problem is we have an overflow abundance of people that contact us every single month. You know, we have over a thousand buyers and sellers that contact the office every single month looking to buy and sell real estate. What we do, which is really unique, is we give appointments to our agents. So someone calls in looking to sell their house, you know, we have a system in place that we assign that appointment. The agent's not going to look for business, calling business back, which is very different. I think a lot of companies give leads. What makes us different is we actually give appointments. I think a lot of agents may be reluctant to go work on a team because they think they're not going to have any freedom. The agents on my team, because they control their schedule where, as you said, they open up their daytime or the days they're available. They open that up. They're able to, to control their schedule where they can have really pursuits of outside interest. For example, one of my top producers, Joe and my team, he travels all over New England. He plays in a band on the weekend, but he'll sell somewhere between 70 to 80 houses this year by himself and still be able to play uh, gigs all over New England and have outside interest like most agents on my team because he controls his schedule. But I think it's important too is what's crazy about the real estate industry. It's the only industry out there. They want you to do all the jobs yourself from calling the leads back, chasing the leads, booking appointments for yourself, showing people houses, the 119 things it takes to sell a house. They expect right. the agent to join that company and do all those things by themselves. But what happens is when you work with me, what's different is you'd really just focus on two or three things. And because you just focus on those two or three things, you have a lot more free time to be able to focus on outside interest besides just selling real estate. But you also make 10 times more money than if you were trying to do 119 things yourself. Talk about the system and the training, the time and effort that you and your team put into training all of the agents that you select to partner up with so they are superstars. The training is really big. That's what we do upfront and forever with, with everything that we do because it's so important because the market's changing, things change so often, but you have this new thing out there, artificial intelligence, how quickly that's taking over things. It's just really being able to stay on top of all the things that are changing and what's coming down the pike. So we do actually just left my Tuesday training every morning on Tuesdays at 930, where the whole team comes together for about two hours, sometimes longer, depends how much we have to go over. And we discuss all new trends that are coming out there, all the new listings that we've got as a team, all the new buyers that we've got on the team, able to match those buyers and sellers together. And then right now, as I'm speaking right now, our, our director of sales is doing sales training, uh, going over basically the two parts that you discussed earlier is, is your job is to meet with clients, help them find a house or to put their house in the market. And we go over our presentations to be able to hone our skills so we get better and better and better. I'll go back to what I said in the beginning of this interview here. We're not trying to build the Navy. We're trying to build the Navy SEALs. So I don't want to have 100 agents, 500 agents all selling two houses a year. Like we're looking for people that are hungry and determined, people that just want to be successful. The best people on our team, we find that they're really good team players. Maybe they came from a team atmosphere or maybe they were in the military, they played you know, sports as a kid. Those people seem to do really good at team environments. I think what we look for the most is the drive and the hunger, how hungry they are. Because let's just face it, a lot of people get in real estate because they're lazy and they just want to get into this, sell a couple houses a year, tell everybody they sell real estate. And when I say that, I would say that's about 80% of agents out there are just lazy. I don't want to offend them, but it's the truth. I don't know how you sell two or three houses a year and what you do with the other 364 days during the year. But we're really looking for people that are saying, hey, listen, I'm selling three to 10 houses per year and I want to sell more. I need to provide for my family. I have aspirations that I want in life and I'll do whatever we have to do to get there. Those people that have that kind of mindset that can think differently, operate differently, and be able to understand how a team system works and follow a process really make the most amount of money on the team because uh, they're able to adapt. They have to be willing to work. Like they're not saying, hey, I got two hours a week because I have another job. Yeah. So they got to be all in. I think that's what we look at the most is the hunger and how determined they are to win.